Hello, this is John. Sometimes when you open an old scene in Maya, you get a message about file contains mental ray nodes. What is this about and how do we get rid of it? Okay, so let's head into Maya and I'll open up an old scene that I made a long time ago. This is actually the first creature that I ever made in Maya back in November 2009 after I switched over from 3D Studio Max. Back then, Mental Ray was the renderer that came built in with Maya. And here's the warning that tells us that the file contains Mental Ray nodes. Ah yes, my good old bat monster. I designed him for a horror film, which ended up not using him, so I thought it would be nice to dig him up and do something with him now. I know three ways that you can use to get rid of the Mental Ray nodes. Firstly, in the Outliner, under the Display menu, Untick the checkbox for DAG objects only. This will display all of the nodes. Now you could look for and delete any mental ray nodes in the outliner. But I don't recommend this method because unless you know what you're looking for, you might not find all the mental ray nodes or you might delete some nodes that you need. Luckily Maya's got a really useful function called Optimize Scene Size, which you can find under the file menu. Click the little box to the right to open the options for optimized scene size. If you scroll near the bottom, you will find an option to remove unknown nodes. This should get rid of the mental ray nodes as well as any other obsolete nodes you might have in your file. And usually this is all you have to do, but it does not always work. So I just saved the scene and let's check if it worked. So I will open up a new scene, and now I will reload the bat monster scene to see if we still get the warning. And there it is. So remove unknown nodes did not get rid of all the mental ray nodes in the scene. But don't worry, there is still one more thing we can do. For this, you have to open up the script editor. Make sure to use a MEL tab, not a Python tab. MEL stands for Maya Embedded Language. Type in this command precisely, including the quotes and the semicolon at the end. Then run it by pressing the blue play button at the top. Now save your scene and let's check if this helped get rid of the remaining mental ray nodes. So I'll open up a new scene and now I will load the bat monster scene again. And this time it's clean, no more mental ray nodes. Hooray! So that's how you can get rid of the mental ray nodes in your old scenes. I hope you found this useful. See ya!